April Fools it's either. Not an April Fool. Some people thought it was, but it's not. Now then, many of us use computer tablets for surfing the internet, checking social media pages, pages, picking up emails, just about everything. Shopping. Yeah, everything. But over the last decade, big names like David Hockney, as you know, have been using them to paint. Well, now a Nottingham artist is using a tablet to create pictures of people and places in the city. Gita Penze has been looking at the process. Coming to life, not on paper, but instead on a screen. From parks and people to churches and cafes. The painter Mick Godley was given the task of capturing three Nottingham neighbourhoods using his tablet. So this is where you painted? Yeah, this is exactly the spot, well, and this is the space that I was working from. You're a traditional painter, why go digital? Um, it's very fast and it's fun, new toys are always fun, um, and uh, the great thing is that you don't have to wait for paint to dry. Mick spent time in Snenton, St Anne's and Hockley eventually producing 50 works. The portraits usually take around 25 minutes and it seems I've become his latest sitter. You use your thumbs. I mean, is it quite hard to get the detail? You don't really need a very fine point, as long as you kind of get the idea of where your fingers are going to be. I work in layers, um, and uh, I try and start quite simply with a bit of background, uh, giving a bit of a colour, um, and then work then sort of with line work at the moment, just to get an idea of the kind of basic drawing, um, and then I can start adding colour to it. Mixed works are on display at City Arts in Hockley and they seem to be going down well. Interesting, it's very interesting. That's what I think, yeah. Because of the way you put it together in um, such a short space of time. I thought it was absolutely fantastic. I just can't believe the way he worked on the iPad. It was just amazing. Um, obviously he had to sit there for 20 minutes still. That was the hardest thing I've had to do for a long time. And whilst Mick still dabbles with a paintbrush, it's clear to see he has the ability to capture anyone on his screen. Gita Pense, BBC East Midlands Today. Fascinating. It reminds me of when I interviewed David Hockney at Nottingham Contemporary, he had two smartphones and he was painting on his smartphones. Okay, cool, it? There's more of those pictures on our Facebook as well. Have a look. Have a look, yes. Let's have some sports.